welcome welcome back to my channel my name is Toluani. so on this channel i upload videos on businesses on career and on education so if you are new here please consider subscribing and to my returning subscribers thank you so much so let's go right into the depression what is depression? What does depression mean? So depression is a mental, mental illness that is associated with persistent feeling of sadness. So are you feeling sad at all time? Is it that things around you that makes you to be happy is not bringing joy to you again? You're already going into depression. So what are the signs and symptoms that you are going to see for you to know that you already been depressed and the first thing is just that things around you that gives you joy will make you to be sad you just see that things that when it has been done before gives you joy it started bringing sadness to your heart like when your friends what they were so before and you'll be happy with it you are no more feeling like that you are feeling being sad at work things that makes you to laugh that makes you to feel happy you are no more feeling happy. What brought about this? What used to happen is just that inability to believe that what has happened has happened. Then you need to move forward in the journey. brings about the pressure to your soul. So another thing I want us to look at is it brings about changes in your sleep. Is it that you see that you're unable to sleep because of things that is flowing in your heart, because of, because of things that you are thinking and you will not be able to sleep anymore. Or some, they will be sleeping too much. So another thing for you to know that if this is happening to you, you are into depression, is that you lost energy. Things that you're, you are able to do freely before, you will not be able to do them anymore because depression has already set in. Another thing is just that in the physical, you will just see that you are feeling headache, you are feeling pains that you can't even know or you don't even know the causes of what brings about it. So you're already feeling depressed already. And the major thing that you will see is just that you started thinking of you committing suicide. You're, you've already lost your self-esteem. The way you are seeing things is upside down. You are not seeing things that there is still hope anymore. If this is happening to you, you are already being depressed. Let me quickly ship in that. When you're having like three or four symptoms of this depression, know that depression has already set in into your life. How can you come out of this depression? There is always a way out of depression. And the first thing is just that you need to go for counseling. You need to look for someone that you trust most. Is it your pastor? Is it an elder? Is it a friend that you can open your heart to at that point in time? The person might not be able to bring solution to what is happening, but you will be relieved in your heart. Just open up to someone. Tell the person, this is what is happening to me. This is what I'm passing through at this moment. Before you know it, you will be relieved. Another thing I will talk about is you finding an environment that will make you to be active. Like you going for fellowships, you going, being at work in the midst of people. Don't look for where it is being isolated. That is going to be only you. Look for where you can meet with other people that when they are engaging you in one or two things, you will be, you will, you will be coming out of that you are passing through. So did you have anyone around you and you've noticed the symptoms? How can you help this person? What we need to do to this person is you must be kind to this person. You have to say positive ways to the life of this person. Don't condemn the person. Don't say any negative ways to the person because this can bring an end to the life of the person. So you have to bring positive ways that is going to give such person hope and come out of what the person is passing through. Another thing we can do is just to make sure that the environment is well secured for the person. Remove every sharp object around you that can that the person can use to harm him or herself to make sure that the person is being saved. 
if the pressure has gotten to a stage that it requires a medical attention, make sure the person seeks seek for medical attention and the person use all the medication that has been given as it has been prescribed. Let me tell you this. Depression does not only happen to an adult, it happens to children also. Did you notice that this child changed suddenly or maybe this child is active before and the mood suddenly changed? You need to see to this. It is either such child is passing through something at that particular time or such person is something has happened and is already affecting the life of those person. You need to help those person at this at this point in time. Know that depression does not start when you are thinking about to committing suicide. It starts from when sadness comes into your life. When you have lost your self-esteem, when everything around you seems to be hopeless, when you don't see that that situation, positive things can come from it. When you began to think that, why does this thing happen? Inability to leave the past and move on with life brings about depression. Are you in depression already? This is the time for you to come out of depression. There is still hope in whatsoever you are passing through. And it is war with us in Jesus' name. If you have not subscribed, make sure you do so. Bye.